right off the bat, no, this has been in the war stage, been in the battle this stage. Yeah, wow, I like can't this. That's a sign right there. If that's the case, that's a sign that you may not be familiar with. Yeah, as you could have just ordered that. Yep. Common Sinji practice is the, that's the first thing he wants to get out because it's a good combo that, starter. Attack, that doesn't work on Grenade. You yep. can shadow sneak out of it and kick him right in the face and do it. Yep. He may have caught him off guard. Let's see what happens the next time a dash attack comes out. You can definitely grab him in between the hits. Although one frame after the final hit, he can act, so you don't want to wait until the whole move is finished. That usually gets you uh, a yep. hit back. So he can just counter that or he can forward it. So right now the green forwarder is the hydrant. Even if Sinji throws out a hitbox, you'll, you'll cut through both. Right now Greninja's doing a lot of this aerial uh, movement. He's trying to uh, get around the hydrant by just going way over with his, with his high jumps. Yeah, and that, that, that's not how you should play. Yeah, he's it's giving up field time. advantage by doing that all the time. Let's see what he got here. Okay. All right, good forward air. It seems like he's slowly trying to figure, he's slowly yeah, get, go, clearing nice out now, time. but now he's at 118. The more you put Pac-Man in the air, the less options he has, because Greninja doesn't have to worry about the hydrant. So one dash attack can give you all the momentum you need. All right, that, that, you can that. that trump right there told me that, oh god, he was not ready for that. At least he'll never have Scurvy okay. again. He should go for it again. Oh, he jumped in air dodge. Yeah. He's afraid of the hydrant. Up air beats the hydrant. So you can just do it with reckless abandon almost. Would you see? Would you read that? Okay, F smash. Now he can seems... hydro pump that pellet. Yeah. You already know that pellet is coming. If you hydro pump the pellet, it just makes Pac-Man lag a little bit, and he's forced to do his up beat. You're right. I know as a Greninja man yourself, and probably one of the, okay, nice. nice up smash, catching that option. Nice. Really, he clipped his foot from the border. Yeah. It looks like he's starting to slowly get it. Up tilt, good. He, he did he definitely had like a big disadvantage early, but good. he's slowly figuring out. This guy has some good adaptation skills. Yeah, this guy definitely figured out what he was doing. You're not gonna punish that. All right, that's the second dash attack. So he's, he still needs to figure out the dash attack there, but since yeah, he's- If Greninja shoots that dash attack, he's not gonna punish it. Oh, reads the second jump. Fine. And Hydro Pump, Pac Man can't catch Greninja if he just Hydro Pumps across the other side of the stage. What I've noticed from Shinji, uh, not just in this match, but in recent weeks, is that his off stage game has gotten a little bit, has gotten progressively more aggressive. Actually. Yeah, yeah. Something I've been telling him for a while. This character can fight, so fight. Oh, nice trump. He tried that earlier and didn't get anything out of it, but him trumping just shows that he's thinking about attacking Whoa, a lot he more. He's trying to grab right through the trampoline. Wow. Up here. Nope. You know the hydrant's coming. You have moves that beat it. Uh oh. That's no good. He jumped to save himself with the momentum. Shift canceling. That's pretty good. At least he knows that. Oh. That's it. That's okay, you nice. Need. Wait on the tech, though. Nice. I can't punish that force, man. Oh, God! He followed. He knew he was going there. If he would have just stood in shield, he would have been fine. I'm not sure why he jumped there, though. I saw Sinji practicing that uh, a little bit today as well. Looks like he's starting to put opponents in situations where they might, uh, you know, start getting a little antsy, and then he throws the side B out knowing that if they are in that direction, yeah. he's going to super armor and kill them. If they're not, then he's relatively safe. Uh, you know, minimal, dam minimal damage possibility there. Let's see if he does better on this stage, because that is a very tough stage for Greninja. I don't know if you guys, a lot of shurikens got stuffed out by a lot, a lot of uh, that may have That may have been the reason why he felt forced to go so high in the air to yeah. avoid everything. It's a, it's a bad stage, so let's see if he does it with the stage that Greninja can actually work on. All right. Another little tip there is Pac-Man can't punish Greninja's narrow field. So you can just kind of like go for that. Yeah, it, it, I mean, although pa since he's, uh, Pac Man's Nair is really strong at three frames to the speed of it, he still has to jump out of shield, and I don't, I think no, his jump not squad. Time, no. Yeah, there's not enough time. The jump squad is like four. Because uh, Greninja's uh, Nair does 11, and he only has 12 frames of landing lag, so there's a lot of shield pressure and not a lot of lag. Yeah, I forget which one it is. I think one of them is plus three on block. No, and that, that should be his Nair. His forward air is like plus five, I think. Really? That's really something ridiculous. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Yes. Protected though, and now we see Deem Doom in the lead. Looks like the stage definitely oh. helped along with the adapter. Oh god, that would have been pretty sick. That would have caught Ooh, me. Up smash. Okay, miss him there. He can just counter it. Yeah, it looks like he doesn't know. He can just counter it. That seems to be the last uh, thing for him to figure out right now in this matchup, just dealing with that Hydra properly. Yeah, he's not. He's playing the neutral perfectly fine. He's not dealing with the Hydra, but he's getting hit with Hydra, and he's not. Oh, the 
Nope, yes. Wow, I don't think he DI'd that, because he was hanging so. there for a second. Okay, uh, straight. The pellet's coming. Oh, he could have down smashed it. But I always use hydro compass to be safe. Wow, that was untakeable. I mean, the untakeable uh, yeah. animation. He didn't have to shoot the hydro. That goes right over the head. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. Nice forward air. Yeah. Picked him out of the air. The pellet's coming. See, he's not anticipating the pellet. He just hi hydro pump. And it will force Pac Man to have to do his up here. And then it's just like so much easier for you to do it. Man. I don't know if you realize part of the spirit can hit him he's armored through it. Yeah. So right now, like the, I think the main things nice. you were saying right there, he does not understand the um what you can do against the hydrant. Yeah, the uh, hydrant would have been great there. And it looks like stage, yeah. He's fighting hard though, but it looks like he's having uh oh. Ooh. That almost he got him. Yeah. Wow. Penalin. We got some juggling tricks right now, Barman Bailey. You can just hydro pump that when he's dropping and it'll push the fruit off stage. Oh goodness! Stop. Cindy, please. I'll throw a kill now. Yep. This is such a massive disadvantage right now. Cindy feels no need to approach. He's also not using Pac-Man's fruit against him. There you go, that's a kill. Bro, okay, now we still have a chance. The Rage we can have a mouth. Pac-Man isn't the best killer. Just watch the apple, watch... Paralyzer was the end. Wow, he just took that. Yeah, the apple just hit him. And that's the set. Well, he shouldn't be hungry for a while. He ate a lot of fruit today. Yeah, he ate a lot of fruit. Yep.